What's going on guys, it's Unknown Player here and today I've got for you guys my first diamond camo with it, Advanced Warfare. I'm going to be showing you guys uh, what the diamond camo looks like on the bell right here. As you know, in my video the other day they fixed the camo challenges so they're not impossibly hard and they no longer reset when you prestige. I have heard some people claiming that they do still get their challenges reset when they prestige. So I would watch out for that and if you've got a camo challenge that is nearly completed I would get that done before you prestige. But here I've got the diamond bell 27. As I said, I do love grinding out camo challenges and as here I have this one right here definitely one of the more popular weapons online right now and it's without a doubt the strongest weapon in the game i would definitely say i wouldn't call it overpowered it's not to that kind of level that guns normally are on cod launches in like the start of games like the msbs and ghost or the foul and black ops 2 i wouldn't say it's overpowered but it's definitely the most consistent and more consistent and kind of reliable than the hbr the ak and i'll be 100 honest i'm really not too impressed with the diamond camo in this game it's nowhere near on the level of black ops 2 diamond just nowhere near that scale where it was like 3d there'd be like actual diamonds on the gun that would stick out and they'd like shimmer in the light this one is really really unimpressive in my opinion and it's kind of like someone got a picture of diamond camo and just like applied it to the weapon you can see it's kind of like worn off in the corners it's almost like a vinyl camo or like a weapon skin of a diamond picture like a photocopy and then just kind of like paste it over the gun it's really really flat and uh, not really too impressive in my opinion but i do feel like they did this for a reason i feel like diamond camo isn't supposed to be the best camo in the game it's supposed to be kind of like a mediocre one and obviously royalty is supposed to be the most special camo so i feel like they deliberately made diamond not as special and as, as amazing it was in black ops 2 for example whereas royalty is the impressive one it's like a pure like really shiny gold and it's got like gemstones and that is definitely the camo to aim for and i'll definitely be unlocking that and showing it to you guys so definitely look forward to that video and in terms of getting this weapon diamond it was pretty tough to be honest you need long shots and headshots for assault rifles and the bow makes it really really difficult mainly because of how it bounces the recoil isn't all that much but it is pretty inaccurate accurate it bounces kind of like an ak was in previous call of duty games and it makes long shots really really difficult and headshots even harder so it's definitely difficult to be precise with this especially at long ranges i mean it does a ton of damage and it's really good close range but at long ranges it's really difficult to get those long shot kills and uh, but i'll show you here the final long shot kill medal that i got to actually unlock the diamond camo just you can kind of see the range and kind of like the distance as an example of what counts as a long shot it definitely took me a while to kind of understand what counts a long shot what doesn't and uh, eventually you just got to kind of figure out a lot of roof tops and kind of like long ranges of sights you basically got to spend most of your time on those kind of picking people off and sometimes it will be hard because they might have AKs which are deadly accurate or snipers which will just one shot you but eventually managed to get this camo done and uh, hopefully you guys enjoy it. if you want to see more diamond camos let me know I'll definitely be bringing more on the way to you guys but hopefully you've enjoyed this look at the diamond camo if you did give it a like rating make sure you subscribe for more advanced warfare videos just like this one and a ton of other content I've got coming on the way so I hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you guys later